Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I need to be really quick because I need to go to school and get in. My helix done by here, my second and third, and then second on here. And so is makeup, but she's getting a helix on this year. So I'm going to school now, so I'm going to see you guys like either in school or after school. And then we're going to go and get our piercings done. We're dressed, so we can't find out. Come on, let's run. <laughs> How do you know? I think he's gone. Yeah, my dad is just not here. Yeah, he's not here. Oh, my dad is just not here. I think I swear his phone's either died or like he's turned it off. I'm saying by you. Is it up there? Because the photo was like up there, wasn't it? Yeah. It's like stinging. Yeah. Is it 
Yeah, it's pretty stingy, you're not. Not really. No. It's entirely up to you with how you're feeling. Do you definitely want to do the lyrics? Yeah. Yeah. It's a good thing that your ears haven't swollen up very much at the moment. If they were swollen up more, I'd probably say I'd stay away from it, but it seems to be handling this really, really well. Oh, the camera's leaving, yeah? Here we go. Here we go, honey. Here we go. One, two, three. There we go. Last one over and done with. Oh, wow. Oh. Bobby's, Bobby's probably just got used to it now. I thought I was going to hear loads of screams then. <laughs> yeah, I know, I definitely would have. I'm such a baby. Right, deep breath in the front of your knee. Alright. Right, you're looking in the mirror, see if you're happy with those. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, because I heard that with you I as heard well. downstairs. I heard proper yeah. screaming and crying. I think when it's was the like, music. you crying or something? When you were downstairs or when you were up? When it was crying. upstairs, I thought these were screaming and crying. I think it was the music because. She said there was one of the quietest, uh, quietest clients she's ever had. <laughs> you got that like Yeah. Huh. Well, I can't get my mask over my face. Hey. Yeah, so I'll just keep it. I feel it, I like it, I want it. I got it, yes I bitches! Chocolate vanilla swear with cookie crunch flavor. Girl, don't do it. It's not worth it. I'm not gonna do it, girl. I'm just thinking about it. 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 Don't let me stop. Yeah. Just to like, you know. These are the piercing. So, this one hurt the most. We did a new life. It did. And then this one. She was crying at me. Oh, I wasn't. <laughs> <Damn it>, <laughs> <laughs> and then, so this one, this one, and then, <laughs> and then, and then, this one, and this then one. this one, and this one. Shut up, you can't even explain. Here's my baby. <laughs> I can't believe you're doing a YouTube video like that. <laughs> And then here's my blue baby. <laughs> and then my karate one. Yeah. Make one to show your earrings. No, earrings. Don't, guys. It's dead hard to put the masks on. It gets stuck behind the helix. It'd be fine with them, but it's the helix. Go down this way. Oh. Aldi to find some little minis. Well, they're not called that, but yeah. Obviously, they didn't have them, so I got some of these instead. It looks really weird because I haven't got like earrings in like my first. Okay. I'm filming on my camera now because my phone ran out of storage. I'm gonna tell you which one was the most painful and then least. My least painful one was this one. Like it was like not even like that bad. I, it did like like hurt like the tiniest bit like out of ten. I'd say like about three. Yeah, about like a three. Um, but obviously like it depends on your ear. Like Meg said as well, this one hurt like the least. And then it would be this one because they were like kind of like the same. 
like piercing if you get a piercing on your right ear like it hurts less than on the left like it hurts more when you get piercing than on the left i actually think that's true so then next i would say my helix like it did hurt but not as much as my third right my third piercing hurt like not not like a lot lot but it did hurt like it's not the it's not the pain when she didn't but the after like after she done it, it started stinging and it felt like my ear was like burning and I was like, my ear's falling off. And then when she done the Helix, I thought, because this one was bad and, be, and obviously people said that Helix is worse than nose ones, but I don't get, like I'm sorry, but like no. How can a nose person, how can a Helix person be worse than a nose? Like a nose one would hurt more. And I thought, because this one hurt, so then this one's going to hurt way more, so then I did close my eyes. But it was not bad, that bad. Like this one out of 10, like the overall like thing when she like done it, would be like out of 10 the pain. Well, it was like, it's like a six and a half I'd say. Maybe a seven, well no, it wasn't that painful but like it did sting quite bad. But yeah, I'd say like about a six and a half. And then like this one, did I say three for that one? Maybe like three and a half or four. I thought when she put it through like that was done, but you have to put it through again. Cause it's like the, because of the jewellery and that did hurt quite a bit on my third when I was like mm, no go away she was like saying that me and Mirka are like a quiet quietest people that like she's had when she's done piercings because like we didn't like hardly say anything like make a noise or anything or like move but like it wasn't that bad but like my third one did hurt like a little bit like it did hurt like not a lot but it did hurt and like about three or four hours it was like stinging and guys if you're wondering why i have leukocyte i like never ever have like leukocyte i think i've only ever had in like my whole like life leukocyte three times like some people might think that's really weird the reason me and Mick got leukocyte was because when you have like a blood test because i don't like needles like it's not that i don't like needle it's like when it goes into my skin like i nearly i almost fainted like i, I literally was like lying on the floor like in like the doctor's place i never want a blood test again they never even got blood for me because they couldn't because my veins are like small or something don't want to think about that they'd done it in my hand i literally told them like 10 times no i don't want it done and so like can you just try and i was like i don't want to but then i just was like fine just do it then because it wouldn't stop saying it. Like, I, like who would want a needle in their hand? And literally, we'd done it and I was screaming. Like, if you ever have a blood test, do not have it in your hand. It hurts so much. Like, normally they do it in, like, the inside of, like, your, like, arm thingy. Which, like, hardly hurts compared to your hand. Some people have it in their wrist as well. Like, no. How? Oh. Some people have it in the neck, which I don't think is bad. Well, it is it is bad, but like not as bad as your hand or your wrist. The person that done the piercing had a piercing by here. I never knew you could get that. Like, how did she get, like, that would have hit a lot. Like, your skin by here is not even stretchy. So, yeah, we went to Boots and then got this stuff for our ears. We're, you have to use salt water. I'll pop in, like, the pictures of, like, the information sheet. So basically we got this from Boots, we went in and asked for like salt water for like, my dad said oh they just had their ears done, then they give us this bit for contact lenses so I'm really confused. And then it has a picture of a plane, which, yeah, and then, but I don't think it's salt water though, it says sterling saline, don't know if that's how you say it, but like, she said that you can use it on your ears, so it, we went to like the pharmacy part, so she, it must be, she must be like, telling the truth because obviously you wouldn't lie and you cannot leave it wet you have to dry it probably some of you probably already know that but yeah there's still blue pen left on it so i'm just gonna clean my ears you have to do it twice a day so i guess you just like kind of clean under it like you've seen i washed my hair yesterday so i'm not gonna wash it today because I've just had my ears pierced as well. Like I used to sleep with my hair up in like a bun or something or like just like a like how I've got it now. But I stopped because like I couldn't do it because my neck hurts. Like and because my neck started hurting and all that. And my neck normally hurts when I go to bed anyways. Not every night but most nights. And now I have to wear my hair like this because it would be fine with these ones. But it's going to get caught in this. And when you wear a mask right you need to be so careful if you get a healing. 
getting it off because you're not supposed to like bang it or anything and when I'm sleeping as well like I would say the side that you sleep on get it on the opposite side but if you want it on that side just get it be like just be careful when you go to sleep I've cleaned it all now I've got my hand in the bottle because I'm gonna go in the shower in a minute um, I'm not gonna wash my hands up like I said before because I did wash it yesterday so obviously it'll be fine for another day. I'm not supposed to wash your hair every day anyway but I've been doing it recently which I know is bad. And guys I do have this app on my phone. I've seen it on Summer Teal's um, YouTube channel like ages ago. I can't remember when I've seen it but it's called Sweatcoin and you basically get like free like money for like you get money for walking like not actually like you can you have like i currently i have 116 pounds and basically you press on spend and then there's like a whole bunch of like things that you can like get um and yeah you do have to pay for delivery i'm pretty sure which i paid four or six pound delivery for what i've got which is good because the original price was so like the thing's free like obviously where like it's not free because you have to like spend your money on that that you do like well it is basically free because all you do is a walk and then you get money um so i got these straws and i had to pay six pound delivery but like normal they're like 20 something pound or 30 something pound which is actually good if you're only paying six pound wanted for ages metal straws like i never use like straws i just normally like, drink them but like i drink chlorophyll water now like I've seen it on TikTok, like big trend on TikTok. Um, you probably would have seen it. And I get mine from Holland and Brava. They're like little like tab, they're like little circle things. But then you know like you know the thing that you mush like potato with. Um, I use that and then like mush it down and then put it in a blender, put water in and blend it because I don't want to eat it just like that. I've tried and it's disgusting, so I just do it like that. And you're only supposed to, don't take more than three though, because that's how many you're supposed to have a day. Like, take like two. Um, so I got these metal straws because they're good for the planet as well. So it says it comes with four reusable metal straws, two straight stars. Two straight stars. Stars? Tars? I can't speak. Two straight straws. Two bench straws. Straw cleaner. Dishwasher safe. But it doesn't, but there's only, oh it does. I literally didn't see that. I was like, there's something missing, but it's not. So basically, it comes with the like, these ones. That, like look, they're like rainbow color, like metallic. So I, I think that's what it's called. But it's, they're really, really pretty. Like I love how the packaging is not plastic as well. And it's like cardboard, so good. And then it comes with a little brush cleaner. And then in here, I have a disty cloth. Apparently this removes makeup with just water You could either get it in black, blue or pink And I decided to get blue Time to see if this actually works So I've actually just done my ears with this salt But I'm really scared because they said that you can't like have it wet Should I try it on? I'm not going to try and take the hoodie off now Because I need to wash my face So I'm going to put some water on this and I'll be back So I guess we're going to see Oh, okay, we're gonna keep going. Shut up. No way, this is like. Wait, 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 wait. There's no way. What? I Guys, I've literally just got water in this. Like, I'm not even lying. I've literally just got water in it. Like, look. This. How? Legit, how? That is. I haven't got enough water on it now, I need to put some more on. Right, so I put some more water, I'm just going to do my eyes a little bit more. I'm sorry, but how has it took my mascara off this? My makeup is never coming off as quick and as good, like I said. So guys, update, it is the second day of me having it done. And I literally tried to put some earrings in, in my first. Not any of these, obviously not, because I only just had them then. But I had these done about when I was like four. Tried to put some earrings in and then I didn't like them because they just look so weird. Literally from Pandora, I can only wear real silver. Like I can't get earrings safe on like Primark because my ears start bleeding. So <laughs> so I've got these, but they you can probably tell that they do not look nice. 
like if i had this earring here then it would look fine but yeah still the pain when i went to sleep like it was hurting my helix was hurting the most and my third the other two don't hurt at all so i would say my second don't hurt it doesn't feel like i've got in my ears and then i went to sleep it took me like 10 12 minutes to get to sleep it was not bad at all at getting to sleep and then i woke up and i was like I thought my earrings come out my ears because I couldn't feel anything in my ears and like there was no pain. As soon as I put the earring in, my ears have started turning again. Even my helix has started turning and I never even touched my helix so... Just don't put any earrings in but I need to like clean them. But I'm really scared because they, all, they literally keep hurting and it's just like... It's not like that bad pain, like it will go but I'm going to try and clean them. And you know when you like rinse like this stuff off, you saw water. And then go in the shower and you know how you can if you have one of them like heads where you can like adjust it do one that's like the slowest one not like a fast one a slow one or get like a jug or like a cup and get like warm cold water whatever whatever you want pour it on your ear try not to get in it in your ear though and just clean it to get like all this stuff off dry it really slowly right you know if you don't know what to dry it with get a towel they say not to dry it with a towel but, you know this part, the end of the towel, is really, really good for patting the ear. Like, when I do it, my second ones don't hurt. It's my third and my helix that hurt a lot. Mostly my third. Um, and then just, like, dry dry the back as well. And then I just dry my whole ear. So, little tips. I don't know if I'm going to update you guys anymore, like, throughout the days. Or I'll just do it in a future vlog. So this is what my ears are looking like. I didn't get, like, fully off. And then this is my other ear. I do actually really like them. I can't wait to like change jewellery. I, I think I might like change this to a hoop and see what that looks like. Next time I get a piercing, I'm gonna get a nose piercing. I'm not gonna get a nose piercing until like the end of this year, only because of Corona and uh, and obviously my nose piercing's gonna hurt after probably like the helix and my third. I'm putting masks on, so I'm gonna wait until we don't have to wear masks anymore, which will probably be in like ten years. So that's where I'm going to get my nose one, probably like the end of this year. I read on Google that your helix takes three to nine months to heal. Like these take like three to eight weeks. So like a month and a half to two months. I'm going to keep my second and third and then second on here in for two months. And then I'll probably keep my helix in for longer just because I really don't want to get infected. I know the jewellery is not nice, but I'm going to keep it in obviously. But the helix one doesn't look bad. Well, well, you can't really see it that much, but so it's fine. I'll just keep that in for like three months or a bit longer. Severin, I've currently got dressed at school and everything. And I try to clean it a little bit more. Like some of the blue stuff is like more of it has come off. So I used salt water, done that, then like washed it off, like dried it and everything. And then the blue went even worse. So then I put some CeraVe on it and it kind of got a little bit more of it off. Don't know if you're allowed to use this, but yeah, you probably are because it's not gonna like do anything to it. So it's just like clean it. So this is what it looks like. Actually, really like them. I didn't put this the CeraVe on this one because like it's not like blue or anything. Well, it is a little bit, but not as much as this like you can still see that it's kind of blue it's not this one it's this one that had loads of blue on because like the pan but i have to wear my hair like this to school which i actually prefer than me having my hair down so this is probably my new hairstyle like it'd be fine with these three but with my helix like it gets stuck and i don't know how i'm gonna put my mask on and off because like when i was putting it on and off yesterday when we went in boots to get that thing it really hurt and my card is like stuck and I had to like do it. Like I'm glad that we do wear masks in school because somebody, you no know, two people in our year got corona, not in our year, in um, year 11 got corona. I literally love them so much. That look really, really nice. I can't wait to change the jewelry room. And there's some exciting videos coming as well because I'm going to Blackpool, not next week, the week after. I'm going to do a room makeover, so I've got this little part, this is what I bought for my room makeover, I've got other stuff, but it's just like in like the other room, there used to be the animals room, but don't have animals in there anymore because they went to my dad's house, like the tortoise and all that. So everyone, it's the next day, and so it's currently Saturday and I had them done on Thursday, so this is the, well, Thursday is the first or second day of me having it, no, because then it's the Friday, but yes, third day, um, and these are my ears, and I'm... And you can probably see some stuff on it. It's the salt. 
because when I said that you're supposed to like leave it on, I just she said dry it with the hair dryer. You know when you're like, oh, and I've like got the cotton bud, so I got the cotton bud and was like, you know, clean. I was cleaning it and then dried it with the hair dryer. And then yeah, this is what it's gonna look like. But I'm gonna take it off in a minute because we're going somewhere in a minute. Well, not in a minute, probably like two hours, which is not a minute. So this is what my ears look now look like. I don't know why, but why does it look blue? I swear like I must have put something on it. Then this is the other one. I think they look really, really, really pretty. So of course I will keep you guys updated in future videos of my ears and like when they've healed and me getting like new jewellery and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing me getting my ears done. Comment down below what ear piercings you have and and if you don't have any, like what piercings you want to get and what piercing hurt the most for you, if you've got any, press the like button and subscribe down below and put the bell on to get notified whenever I upload a brand new video. And I'll see you all in my next video. So I'm going to come on here and update you. I did end off the video and I did upload it on YouTube. And I put it on private because I didn't finish doing the thumbnail. But I'm going to delete it and then add this on and then upload it. My ears are infected. And it's not because I haven't been cleaning them, because I clean them twice a day with this thing that I got from Beach, but I didn't, but I don't know if it's any good. Um, and then salt water, twice a day, morning and night. I haven't cleaned them now because I'm scared that I don't, I don't know if you still like clean them. Like obviously I'll clean them, like, but I don't know about this one. It says on Google to remove it with cotton wool. Right, click away now. No, like skip the video a bit if you don't want to see the pictures of my ear. So I'm going to put a picture up of what it looks like because you can't see on here. It just looks like it's a bit of like black pen. It's actually dried up blood because that's what my mum said and it is. When I've like looked on the picture and then I went to look on Google what like what does infected ears look like. And then it says if them like blood is coming out like dried blood and it is. So my ears. So it's only my third one though and it's really weird how that one hurt the most and afterwards it did and i've got no and guys my ears are bruised the only one that is literally completely fine is my helix which you would have thought that would have been the worst because that takes like a really long time to heal as well should have thought that, that would have been like the worst like there would have been blood coming out that and then they would have been like bruised but basically behind here i'll pop pictures in so if you don't want to see it again then skip um it's all bruised at the back of my ear i don't think that like yesterday it was there that's when i took the pictures but the day before i don't know if it was there and no, i don't think it was and then behind the this year i don't want to lift it up because it's going to start hurting um i'll pop a picture there's bruising on these two as well and then on my helix it's fine like that's fine that's healing fine they're all like bruised and all that apart from my helix like I would have thought that my helix would have been like really bad.